A kidnapped woman left brain damaged after falling from a van tells, tells her mother she loves her by sign language and emotional scenes in a new documentary. The film captures the poignant moment Angel Lynn, 21, uses her hands to speak to parent Nikki, 48, to speak TP her. She suffered catastrophic brain injuries when she fell out of a moving van headfirst at 60 miles per hour on the A6 after being kidnapped by her ex-boyfriend in September 2020. The moment is shown in Channel 4's documentary The Kidnap of Angel Lynn Tonight. She can be seen in the film in her mobility chair as Nikki tenderly holds her hand and tell her you will get there you know. You have come so far in the last year. And as her mother tells her I love you, Angel points to her eye, her heart, then her parent before making the number two with her fingers to reciprocate back. Nikki replies to her I know you do baby. She and Patrick Lynn, 53, were told their daughter would not survive. CCTV caught the moment Angel was forced into a van by Bosco and his accomplice Rocco Sansom in Rothley, Leicestershire, in September 2020 after an argument. She then fell out of the vehicle, which was driven by Sansom, as it traveled at 60 miles per hour, before she was found by horrified members of the public. Bosco was jailed for seven and a half years earlier this year while Sansom received 21 months. Bosco's sentence was later increased to 12 years, although Sansom's was not changed. Angel has defied the odds and can now stand and she has started to swallow. Nikki, who runs a cleaning business, told The Sun, she is communicating more and more. I know it won't change things, but I'm hoping one day she will speak and tell me what happened. I do think she was pushed because of the injuries she suffered, the force with which she hit the ground. Angel, from Loughborough, who is recovering and undergoing rehabilitative treatment, after Che Bosco, the ex-boyfriend, left her paralyzed and unable to eat, walk, or talk by herself. Nearing the end of the relationship, Bosco became increasingly threatening and Angel began to withdraw before attempting to leave him. In September last year, Angel's mother said she was warned her daughter's injuries were fatal but she was starting to regain movement on her left side and relearn how to swallow. Angel's fight for survival has astonished doctors at the Queen's Medical Center, nodding in where she was given the last rites three times. Her family hoped that soon she might be able to recount what happened in the run-up to Bosco kidnapping her. CCTV caught the moment Angel was forced into a van by Bosco and his accomplice Rocco Sansom in Rothley, Leicestershire, in September 2020 after an argument. She then fell out of the vehicle, which was driven by Sansom, as it traveled at 60 miles per hour, before she was found by horrified members of the public.